Hey, this is Evan at Sarah Laser. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate a cool new technique we figured out here uh, using the LightWeld 1500XC. Uh, this technique can be done with any of the LightWeld systems with the cleaning capability, which uh, is, is the XC or the XR. And what I'm going to be doing is uh, using a stencil and the, cl and the cleaning mode. And uh, I will be making marking on the surface of, of a metal. So uh, let me move over here to the light weld and I'll show you what I'm doing. Um, actually, I'm just going to go straight over to the part, the camera, not cooperating all the way. All right, so uh, what I've done is I have decided to use a uh, cleaning function with the light weld. So I have a cleaning nozzle here. Uh, this is my stencil. This is a product line that we sell, which is a fiber laser welding enclosure. Um, and so what I'm going to do is uh, hold this really steady. I could use the, the clamps. And then I'm going to use the cleaning pass to go over it and uh, mark the surface. Uh, so I might have to make a couple passes just because this is a little wider than the cleaning pass of the laser, which is uh, limited to 15 millimeters. So, okay, so let me uh, zoom in a little bit here. I'm going to turn on the cleaning mode. So I am there. Put on my uh, safety gear here. All right, here we go. Give this a try. <laughs> so this process could be good for uh, part numbers on your products. Custom logos. Ideally, you would want to size your font to match the width of the laser. Uh, in this case, we did not do that. So I'm kind of having to go over certain areas a little differently. All right, so I'm going to look at it real quick, make sure I touch up any areas. Yeah, it looks like that's it. Oh, one more. Okay, so let's remove our stencil. All right, so that is now marked into our surface. Uh, now let's see what it looks like on a different kind of material. This is a uh, mild steel. Let's move over to some uh, stainless steel. And I'll just mark these smaller, uh, the smaller fonts because this one is, uh, should be made smaller in order to go over it easier. Here's a stainless steel. All right, that came out really good. Look at that. Just do a little bit more here.
Yeah, that is awesome. All right, let's get one more uh, full size logo just for fun. All right, and then we'll we're gonna add our logo onto this piece that we made. Uh, we were playing around with some scraps, and I realized that we had just what we need to make a big old sword. So take a look at this uh, nice big sword we made. This is all fusion welded with the light welds. First, first I'll show off some of these welds. Nice, beautiful fusion welds. Really good penetration there. All right. So let's put our logo right on here. Find the best way to do this. Beautiful. There we go. Look at that. That's awesome. All right. Thanks.